Hi guys, what's going on? It's the Digital Tutor here with another step-by-step -step tutorial. In today's video, I'm just going to show you how to disable parental controls on a Windows 10 PC or laptop. And if you do find this helpful, please leave a like and drop a comment below. Also, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more step-by-step -step tutorials, how-tos and tips and tricks for everything tech and digital related. So in order to do this, first thing we're going to want to do is come down to the search bar down here in the bottom left hand corner. And then we want to go ahead and type task manager and open up the task manager app, which is which will come up under best match. So from here, what you're going to want to do, if you look at the top of the screen, you've got uh, these different tabs. And what you're going to want to do is click on two services. And then we're just going to scroll down pretty much all the way to the bottom until we get to uh, W and what we're going to do it's this one here WPC uh, MONSVC you can tell which one it is because in the description it's actually going to say parental controls what you're going to want to do is actually right click on this and then click on to open services then after a minute or two that's actually going to load up a um, screen that looks like this and then from here, what we're going to do is actually locate parental controls. So if we actually scroll down uh, till we get to P and you'll see what's going to happen is going to be the parental control setting there. So what we're going to do is just right click onto this and then go down and click onto properties. And then from here, what we're going to do is just click onto where it says startup type. We're going to click on the down box and then we're going to set that to disabled click apply and then OK. And what's going to happen, that's going to uh, now say disabled, which means the parental controls is now disabled. So that's how you do it and I hope you did find that helpful. If that did help, please leave a like and drop a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you do want to help support the Digital Duty channel, there is a link in the video description down below. If you go and give that a click, you'll be able to buy the team here a cup of coffee. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.